engineering brings so many things to the table. iPhones will just keep getting bigger and computers will just keep getting thinner. Robots. Technology can empower people. Holographic TV. Video games make me feel like I'm going into like a whole new world. Electronics would be taking over everything. I love engineering. I think it's fun. Virtual reality is something that you can put on a screen to trick our brains to believe that something else is happening than what's currently happening. I went to try the Oculus Rift Crescent Bay prototype demo. There's all of these special ops guys trying to fight some robot invasion. Put yourself like right in the line of fire and then take yourself out right at the last moment. And that's when you get chills down your spine that I have left the environment I'm currently in and I am now somewhere else. We're working on a lot of technology to turn real people and digitize them into photorealistic virtual characters. People think video games are just 12 year olds play and scream at screens for no reason. And while that's partially true, people could use video games, motion control and the Oculus Rift to better understand like what other people around the world are going through. One project we're doing, you can ask questions of a survivor of the Holocaust, kind of projected holographically in front of you, life-sized, and have them actually reply back with appropriate responses. So we're trying to make it possible that you can speak directly to history, and this can live on forever. How did you survive the Holocaust? How did I survive? I survived. I think technology can help us because maybe instead of reading about something that happened in the news, we can actually talk to a person who is there. There's a lot of things that we need to change in the world. I think it should look like a healthier, happier environment. Uh, my ideal world would be where people are living in peace. My statement would be helping build a future for not just this next generation, but the generation after that, and the generation after that.